Hey guys, it's uh, been a long time since I posted a video, so I know I needed to get one out today. Sorry about that. I've just been busy doing real life stuff. Not that this isn't my real life, but you understand what I'm saying. So the exercise today is uh, based on an exercise someone gave me. He actually used to be an old teacher of mine in school. And he used to be a drummer. And he told me that you don't really need a kit to practice, and it was basically an exercise based on just tapping with your hands and your feet, but I've transcribed it to the kit. And this is the exercise originally is, it's, I'll show you, one, one, two. Just going one, two, three, four, but you do one once, two, two times, the three, three times, the four, four times. If that makes sense. Uh, here's it a little bit faster. kind of changed the positioning of everything uh, by just, you're doing right hand and right foot and left hand and snare originally because like I said it's not for the drum kit really, it's just kind of an exercise if you're waiting in line somewhere or you're not at your drum kit you can do it on your hands and feet. But I just changed that doing the right hand and left foot and then snare drum and bass drum right I kind of switched the feet which actually makes it sound I think better on the drum kit maybe not better but sounds different listen uh, I think something to do with the snare and the bass makes it sound more powerful. Let me try to do it fast. I might mess up. <laughs> yeah, see, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of 
messed up that too. I'm sorry, it's not it's not flawless, but I think you guys are understanding uh, what I'm trying to show you. <laughs> so work on it, develop it into your own, and it should help your coordination. Peace.